I'm Benjamin Lauder. I'm the creative director for Buckminster Fuller's Center for Spirituality and Sustainability. I'm also honored to be one of a group of seven artists who are creating work for the Murals on the Meridian Project. This healing art project is a potent mix of sacred geometry, ancient healing traditions, street art, and the legacy of Buckminster Fuller. It's bringing seven powerful art installations to seven key locations across the center of the United States. There is an invisible line that runs through this land. Here in the United States, it starts in New Orleans, Louisiana. It travels up along the Mississippi River Valley through some of the most fertile soil in the world, eventually making it up to the Great Lakes where half the world's fresh water natural resources are. It's the 90th longitudinal meridian, and visionary genius Buckminster Fuller used it as a tool to help us see the world differently. The conventional classroom map uses the equator as its central reference point. Fuller chose to use the 90th meridian as the spine of his reoriented map. He called it the Dymaxion map, and it accurately shows the Earth's land as a unified mass spreading out from the North Pole. From this vantage point, we see the world differently, and our connection to it and to each other is renewed. We are living in challenging times. We are experiencing a once in a 65 million year extinction event. Nothing like that has happened on the planet since the time of the dinosaurs. And it's all due to human behavior. And it started when science demonstrated that the world and the planet is nothing more than an object to be bought and sold as a commodity. Buckminster Fuller taught us that if we don't like the way that the world is, we don't fight against that existing reality. We create a more attractive model that replaces it. So within that spirit, we've created the Murals on the Meridian Project to help people remember that the world is imbued with the same sacred spirit that we are. The oldest cultures on the planet were able to define energetic centers along the vertical meridian of the human body. These seven energetic centers are known as chakras, and they work together as a balanced system to maintain the health of the living body. To help us see our planet as a living body, Murals on the Meridian has projected these same chakras onto the Earth's 90th meridian to bring balance and health to the land that our lives depend upon. On the campus of Southern Illinois University in Edwardsville, Illinois, this same 90th meridian passes through the geodesic dome of the Center for Spirituality and Sustainability. The center was designed by Buckminster Fuller and his architectural partner Shoji Sadao and stands today as one of the most important artifacts in Fuller's legacy. The funds from this project will go towards the continued preservation and activation of the center as a beacon for global unity that Fuller intended it to be. Our project has all the pieces in place. It has the artists that we hope to attract. It has the locations. It has the complete package. The only thing it's missing is you. And it was made for you. Because without participation, this project is nothing. So if this is the type of thing that you would like to see happening in the world today, then vote with your dollars in support of this crowdfunding campaign. And plus, you can get some great premium gifts. So thank you for being a part of this landmark art project.